This is the WCIA3 Morning Show, live on my CFN TV. All right, thank you, Jennifer. Well, the U of I is having an open house upcoming, is showcasing its best and the brightest students and their exhibits. Here to tell us more about the open house is Megan Simant, the EOH director, and Steve Ward, an electrical engineer who's brought this cool demonstration. Well, first of all, Megan, tell us a little bit about the open house. Okay, well, Engineering Open House um, is in its 88th annual year at the University of Illinois. It is a two-day science fair where the engineering quad just opens up to projects from students, from teachers, from anyone who wants to come and show what they've made. And it's just a great, it's a great thing for everyone, ages, you know, infants to old engineering um, alumni. <laughs> um, but Steve actually brought one of his projects for this year, and you, I guess, is here to talk about yeah, it. Yeah, just one of the many that will be on display at the open house, right, right. Steve? Yeah. So... <clears throat> What I have here with us today is a, uh, a Tesla coil. These were invented by Nikola Tesla back in the, uh, around 1890. And um, <clears throat> I've been doing this as a hobby since about the eighth grade. And uh, one of the tricks I've sort of come up with is um, to modulate it with music. So a Tesla coil normally generates this miniature lightning display. And um, what I can do is control this lightning display to uh, produce musical tones. Okay, how uh, does that work? Right, so Mark here, uh, our performer, is uh, playing on this fingerboard which sends MIDI data, and MIDI is sort of like how electronic uh, instruments talk to each other. Uh, so that MIDI data is coming into my controller box here, and it's sort of taking that data and spitting out test tones to this Tesla coil that turn it on and off. So what we're actually hearing is a bunch of miniature lightning bolts firing off uh, 100 times per second or so. And uh, we change the, how many times it fires off in a second to produce the musical tones. Okay. Just by, push, just by him playing, pushing the, the, yeah. the fingerboard there? Very cool. All right, it'll show us how it works. Okay. I just need to flip a few switches and All then right, it's go ahead. Uh, ready to go. Done. Okay, Mark. Ready? Yeah, you should be. Kill the lights. Very cool. It's pretty cool. So uh, quickly, how does that? How does it work? Why are we able to see that and hear that? So the Tesla coil is producing an enormous voltage at this output terminal here, so much that it shreds the air molecules near it and uh, produces that purple light. Um, and every time that happens, the air is uh, expanding from the heat generated, just like a lightning strike. Mm -hmm. And uh, if we can fire that off fast enough, we can hear those tones being produced. Oh, very cool. And uh, a miniature, you, you should say, a display yes. of a concert that y'all are going to have yes. coming up. Tell us a little bit about is, the concert. Yeah, this is just a miniature uh, demo version. Uh, for EOH at uh, 9 p.m., mm -hmm. uh, well, this is a special event for EOH at 9 p.m., uh, we'll have two large Tesla coils standing about seven feet tall each uh, behind awesome. Engineering Hall. Uh, we'll have Mark performing live on the continuum and... Uh, it should be a great concert. Uh, and that's Friday, March 7th. Friday, yes. March 7th. All right, and then you have events all throughout the day on Friday and Saturday. If folks want more information on when and where, how can they get a hold of you? They can definitely visit our website. Um, there's information on every design contest, um, entertainment and food, and all the exhibits. They can even search through them. All right, Megan, Steve, thank you very much for coming in today. We appreciate thank your time. You. Thanks. All right, folks, you can go to the website, find all the information you want, or if you want to see replay of the segment, go to our website, IllinoisHomePage.net, and click on As Seen on 3. We'll be right back.